hello everyone in this video i want to show you how to import your uh, architectural plan from autocad to etabs and uh, automatically automatically generate uh, beams floors columns walls and grids okay this is a second video in my channel channel uh, to show this and uh, uh, I have showed uh, in my first video another method and in this video I want to show you uh, second method uh, for import from AutoCAD to ETABS okay first you need to uh, draw all of the beams let me show you okay these are beams of project I have drawn all of the beams and you can draw all of the beams easily from column to column okay after that uh, and be careful beams should be drawn with line command after that you need uh, to draw all of the floors Floors should be closed polylines. These are floors of my project. We can simply draw them by boundary command, for example. Let me show you. isolate all of the beams and then select floors or yes I delete this one I use boundary command okay simply you can draw all of the floors by this command or polyline commands and all of them should be closed polyline see they are closed Okay, after that you should draw all of the walls of your project. These are wall of my project. And again walls should be closed polyline. These are walls of my project and they are close polylines. Uh, after that you need to draw grid of your project and grids should be line command you can draw all of the grids easily with line command 
and uh, also columns should be again closed polylines and uh, be careful uh, etabs can't read uh, blocked objects and if your columns for example were in blocked explode them to be in polylines because uh, otherwise uh, in in that case uh, etabs can't read block comments okay and be careful uh, you should move your architectural plan to zero 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 coordinate c This is zero, zero, zero. I can select all of the plan and move to zero, zero, zero. I have all of the objects, grids, columns, floors, beams, and walls and this architecture plan is ready to be imported to etabs so I save this one to DXF and close Then I should go to ETABS, new model, with settings from model file, for example, I select this one, and you should use blank. Then I import from DXF file of architectural plan. I select this one sample, and uh, my units are in meter. See distance between these two column is. seven meters so I should select meter and then the story one and okay I go to a story one if you don't have the plan you can check this one architectural plan layers to show your plan okay from model explorer display architectural layers first I create beams by right click and then add beam objects Okay, wait to create the etabs create the beams all of the beams okay after that I select the layers of column in the AutoCAD AutoCAD it was columns etabs I right click on columns and add column object Again for floors, add area objects. For grids, add grid. And for walls, add wall objects.
these are walls okay I have everything and uh, a little more addition is needed so first I select beams see beams are non sections so I should select properties from sections non and then assign frame for example beam 40 40 okay then I should select columns assign for example column 40 40 after that I should select floors again floors are none see select properties slab sections now and then assign shell leg section for example joist or everything you want and finally for wall sections i should select all of the walls and then assign shell wall section of 40 centimeters for example in this project See, these are walls of the project. Oh, 40. I need a little addition for grid. So I, so I should go to grid modify show grids uh, I should select the name of the grids for example no. A or one two three four These are for X direction A, B, C. are in the end point of the lines so I can or better solution is to select all of them copy go to Excel paste and type start then copy 
and paste. Okay. I have all of the objects, grid lines, beams, columns, floors, and I don't want architecture plan layers anymore. I have all of the objects. And I can select all of them and by replicate copy them to other stories. See these are all of the objects of my project. But by this method you can easily model your structure in eTabs and uh, it is very fast and easy. If you like my video please give me a beautiful like. Thank you.